Hi everyone. Uh, I'm Nate. I'm Sarah. And today we are doing things a little bit different. Mm -hmm. We're going on a thrifting adventure. So our neighborhood Goodwill, um, which is the closest thrift store to us, uh, has been closed since the pandemic. So we're going on a little tour of thrift shops up in Vancouver, right above us. Yeah, I was gonna say, this time we're actually we're in Washington. We're not going to the thrift stores in Oregon. Mm -hmm. So, we're gonna see how it goes. We're gonna go to a couple Goodwills, and there's another one that's not a Goodwill. Potentially two that aren't Goodwill. Ooh, potentially two. I don't know why, the Pacific Northwest just loves Goodwill. Yeah. <laughs> or they love us. <laughs> right. <laughs> okay. So, let's see how it goes. Wish us luck. Here's my lighting. Look at my little poof, my little cotton teal. <laughs> my funny little layers. Sydney, please okay. fix. Okay. So, we've gone to three Goodwills so far. I think it's gone pretty well. It's gone really well. We haven't left some a store without anything yet. We've spent a lot. Yeah, but we bought some stuff that we know we're gonna resell. Yeah. Because we're like, I just can't leave this behind. And it's also, so it's a little different right now because of COVID. So you can't try on anything at any of the thrift stores that we've been to, mm -hmm. which means you kind of have to just... Know your size. Yeah, know your size, know your fit, or else just be willing to commit to it. Um, so we bought a bit of things that I might not have gotten if it wasn't for the fact that I know I could resell it mm -hmm. if it doesn't fit me like I hoped. Yeah. Um, but now we're going to our first, um, what's it called? Retails, like a, a tail tail. Yeah. Yeah. But, um, yeah. Oh, thrifting's also a little different right now. I always was hesitant to, like, touch things in the thrift store and then, like, touch your face. So definitely don't do that. But we brought hand sanitizer, so we're... Mm -hmm. Hand sanitizing the whole way, whole way around. Mm-hmm. Okay. Oh, and we've also had one snack break. <laughs> we did. We had a little snack break. <laughs> we stopped to Taco Bell. Oh, no, we're running out of battery. Mm. But we get we have vegan options at Taco Bell, FYI. Yeah, so... Make, you can, anything, you can switch the... Meat with beans and make it fresca style so that there's no dairy in it. Mm-hmm. He gets a crunch wrap and I got two hard shell tacos. Mm-hmm. Mm. Let's do it. Mm-mm-mm. mm, mm, mm. mm, mm, mm. Focus. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, one, two, three. Hi, Hi everyone. everyone. I'm Nate. I'm Sarah. Oh, we already did this, so we don't have to do this again. <laughs> we did this in the car. So, hello Wait. again. Yeah. We're we back. Did, we did it in the car. So, we made it back from our thrift trip. Mm-hmm. Our that was hard for me to say. One day thrifting road trip. <laughs> it was really like the whole day. We left at like 10:30 mm -hmm. or something like that, mm -hmm. and got back what like five. 4.45? Yeah, more like 4. Because it's like 5.20 right now. <laughs> we went back for... Yeah. Yeah. But it was a fun little trip. We went to three different Goodwills and then one other thrift store. It was the um, Humane Society's like charity shop. Yeah, was it called Retail? But like spelled like T-A-I-L? Like a dog I've already tail. decided that that's where I want to start donating my... Like when I make donations of clothing and books and things. Oh, yeah, yeah. I don't care that it's far. We have to drive there and donate yeah, it. You could drive there. Okay. I'm just kidding. <laughs> uh, so we are going to do a little thrift haul, show y'all what we got. Mm -hmm. We got mm -hmm. quite a bit of stuff, so a lot of books. Yeah. She's got a lot of books. Because she doesn't have enough books yet. I know, this no, is the one kidding. video we're not in front of the bookcases. I know. <laughs> That's because I was too ashamed. I, was like, I got some I books, though, problem. too, so... You want to start? What should we start with? Books? Uh, you got a lot, so. Let's go. <laughs> should we start with the miscellaneous first? The things yeah, that yeah. aren't books or clothes? I didn't get I had two things that are not book and clothes. Me too. Oh, all right. You want to go first with me? Um, I'll go first. 
I got an AC Reed record saxophone. Saxophone is her instrument, so I picked that up. Mm -hmm. Also picked up little Quincy Jones, the dude. Oh wow! Quincy Jones, legend. I ain't gotta I can't say. Can't believe you found that there. I know, right? So. That's a beautiful cover too. I know. I'm super happy about both of those pickups. Uh... What you get? <laughs> Yours is like really cool, and I'm like, Mama Mia, here, here we go, go again. again. No, nah, I like this movie. So. <laughs> It's super cool. About. We love Mamma Mia, so now we finally own it. We own it. Okay. Yeah, sorry. So yeah. you're good. Dun, da, da, da. Oh, yeah. It's a little it's backpack. It's kind of hard to see because it's dark in here, but it's a little backpack. I've been stealing Nate's, like, actual, like, backpack backpack every time we go on, like, a little mini trip, which is too big for what I need. I really just need something that holds, like, a book and yeah. my notebooks, and that's it. So she got a nice little backpack. Yeah. Nine West in great condition it was 50 percent off so it was six dollars it's perfect okay okay books books sorry if you don't care about books but she got a lot of books skip it if you want yeah we'll just go quick go back and forth yeah okay i got the sixth extinction by elizabeth colbert um, -da -da. i got luther the calling by neil cross based off of or not based off of but same as that netflix show from the BBC. Okay, and then I got The Sun is Also a Star. So that one is now a movie, so. Oh, funny. Mm -hmm. I got uh, Armada by Ernest Cline. Um, the Joy Luck Club by Amy Tan. So, FYI, when we are shopping at um, their stores for books, I always have the Goodreads app out because they can you can scan the barcode of any of the books or type in the title and it'll automatically just pop up reviews and ratings for the books because mm -hmm. there's a lot of like really bad quality books at thrift shops. Yeah. But these ones, that like weeds out the bad ones. <laughs> mm -hmm. uh, I got Social Death by Tatiana. I'm not saying her last name. <laughs> look, uh, look at it. Bonk, you know. Bonkabani? Okay, whatever. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay, and then I got two um, from the same series. I, they didn't have the first one, but it looked good, so I'll just find the first one used online. Um, Ignite Me and Unravel Me by Tahere uh, Mafi. The first one's called Shatter Me, so we're going to look for that. Bing. We'll let you know in some random video if we find it. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I got Schools Out Forever by uh, Scott K. Andrews. Fact. It's a big book, 700 something pages. Yeah. I've always wanted to read a really big book, so I got one. <laughs> you just finished it. Oh, but you did it I didn't book. read it, though. I like the true. satisfaction of reading oh, 700 pages. Oh, this is pages. yours. Oh, that's me. Okay, now you can go ahead. Okay. Um, I finally got a copy of Margaret Atwood's, um, Margaret? <laughs> Margaret Atwood's, uh, The Handmaid's Tale. Bam. I got The Orpheus Descent, uh, by Tom Harper. Okay, I got another classic, a uh, girl with a pearl earring. Oh yeah, the classic. Look how cute. Mm-hmm. And then my last book, I got The Dragon Heir by Cindo Williams Chima. So. That one looks good. Yeah. Okay, and then this is another one that I was like, I've been wanting to read this one. I almost read it for a book club. Um, Where'd You Go, Bernadette? This one's really popular right now, um, by Maria Semple. Maria? Maria. Maria. <laughs> and then The Storyteller's Secret by Sejal Bandani. And then these two are also, these aren't the first in a series. They're like the second, I think, in both of the series, but they both looked like really good series, so I got them anyways, and I will find them used. The first one's used. <laughs> so this one's called Betrayed by Arnaud or, sorry, by Lynn Carthage. Bam. And uh, Shelter of the Most High by Connellyn Cassette. Bam. I know you're not supposed to judge a book by the covers, but... That's usually what I've been looking at, though. It can give you a good vibe sometimes. That's how I pick out records that I don't know. I don't do that with records at Goodwill because you yeah. can't listen to them first. Mm -hmm. But at a record shop, I will pick out the covers that I like and then go listen to them. Yeah, well, I feel like a lot of Because that's times, a good way to get you into listening to something new and not just looking for the same stuff you've been listening to. This is true. Well, a lot of times with books, I feel like based on the style of the cover, you can tell what genre it's going to be. That's so, true. like, if it's, like, a very funny, like, um, 
like combined photo and there's someone shirtless, like probably not gonna be for me, but. Yeah. <laughs> Close time. Okay. All right. You go first. So I got this. Oh, I love this one. Nice little button up. Mm -hmm. Bam. I don't know how well you can see it, but I got that. <laughs> okay. The floor. Um, I went a little sweater crazy, but that's all I wear. Yeah, let's be pan let's be real about the pandemic situation. It's like we spend most of our time at home, so I'm like everything I want to wear is gonna be comfortable. Mm -hmm. So that means sweaters because I run cold. So I got this cardigan. It's really cute. Uh, I also got this button up. Another one. Party button up. Yeah. Spice up those uh, webcam meetings. Yeah. Okay, and then I got this Pendleton like women's shirt jacket. Mm -hmm. Shagget. Shagget. <laughs> uh, yeah. I got this referee shirt. No, I'm just kidding. It's for my mime costume. Once again, <laughs> just kidding. But I got this shirt. I like it. I didn't even think about that. Maybe I'll borrow a be mine. We don't, you can't just steal them. I have a uh, thing and everything. What? What's it called? A beret. I got a beret and everything. I'm gonna be a mom. <laughs> a, the first black mom you ever seen. I'm just kidding. <laughs> okay. okay, I got this white turtleneck oh, that Nate is very jealous of. I am. I'm looking for like a sweater turtleneck yeah. in white. Honestly, it's, so it's hard to find white things sometimes at thrift shops. Um, Cause it's all stained. Yeah, but a lot of times though, you do when you do find it though, it's since it's vintage, it's a material that doesn't get as pilly because it's from the '90s and not from uh, the last like five to ten years. Yeah. So like this one is like a material that's not gonna get pilly, which was what happens to all of my white sweaters, and I drive me bananas. It's a good material. Um, do you have more? Yeah, I'm gonna do this one first. I got this little yeah jacket. Here's a jacket. My my bane yeah. jacket. For those of you who've seen Dark Knight Rises, I got my Bane <laughs> jacket now. All right. Oh, you done? No, I have two more. Okay. And then I got this kind of um, what did I call it? A '50s newspaper boy. Mm -hmm. It's either <laughs> like that or like, like Riverdale. Oh yeah, there we go. It's my Riverdale cardigan. <laughs> you could be someone from Riverdale. <laughs> I don't Halloween. even watch Riverdale though. We yeah, stopped. I might give it another try. We stopped watching after sing, uh, season two when they brought in Jingle Jangle. Jingle Jangle. But then it yeah. is based off of like an old comic, so Jingle yeah. Jangle, yeah, it makes Ridiculous. sense. But this sweater's really soft. Okay, then I picked this up, and this I'm gonna try and sell on Poshmark. It is a Levi's yeah. little denim. I wouldn't call it a jacket, but it's another like it's, it's like a, a dress shirt. A like, shirt jacket. Shirt jacket. It's a yeah. jacket. It's a shacket. That is the term of the season. Okay. Okay, and the last thing, another sweater. <laughs> What did I call this? Um, this is like 90s or 2000s um, soccer player. You know what they look like? They look like the sweater that every single girl in a Hallmark babysitting murder movie is wearing. <laughs> it's perfect! <laughs> okay. I also picked these up. These are a size 11. They're some Nike SBs. Mm -hmm. I really wish they were size 12, but they're not. So I'm going to try and sell these on Poshmark as well. Yeah. And then I, like, I got this great jacket this great little what is it called is it a jacket or a blazer or a i don't know it's nice clothes. yeah i got this it looks really nice i love it a lot you like can't see it <laughs> you can't see it very well you'll probably see me in a video wearing it sometime yeah. so i'll give you a little fashion show yeah later and that is That's the it. haul that's we what we would do up. a try on. We talked about doing a fall like fall outfits video and things, but uh, we didn't do it because it felt kind of r ridiculous because this no, fall season no is different and we don't want to encourage people like going out and about like socializing to show off their outfits when we shouldn't be doing that. So, I, I won't lie, I'd be getting like dressed just for the house. Yeah, totally. That is, yeah. This fall is like wear whatever the heck you want. It doesn't matter. Whatever makes you feel good. Right? <laughs> Because unless you live in like a big city, you're really not going to see a lot of people. Just a little thing from like a, a lighter video of like surviving the pan uh, 2020 or whatever. Mm -hmm. Good thing that I learned is if you're working from home, don't do it in pajamas. Get dressed. <laughs> also, another yeah. good tip with that, walk around the block so you acting like you're going to work. True. That's all we have for today. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. Mm -hmm. Hit that like and subscribe buy used, button. Not new. Yes, buy used. It's great. It's way more fun. Yeah. Way more unique stuff. Mm-hmm. Better for the earth. Better for your wallet. Mm-hmm.
It's already lasted this long, so it's probably gonna last a while. Or at longer. least look for it used before True. you That's buy. True, a good start. Because the sweater, mm -hmm. the turtleneck sweater, I'm probably gonna end up buying it new because I can't. I went to three Goodwills, four Goodwill, or two, yeah, three Goodwills, another thrift shop, and couldn't find it. Yeah. I might go to another Goodwill. We'll see what happens. But. Yeah. There's some things that's like if you really, really want it and yeah. you've tried, <laughs> you know, it's like, you know, you can only do so much. Yeah. But hit that like and subscribe button. Uh, we love you and see you next time. Bye.